Good morning, I'm Brian Reagan. This is Tyler Kelly. Yeah, today we're in Proverbs 26 and verse 20, which says, For lack of wood, the fire goes out, and where there is no whisperer, quarreling ceases. Tyler, give us your scholarly insights on this. I would say if you don't have anybody who you can use the problem, but <clears throat> continuing to spread it around, it gets dropped or it doesn't get escalated further than it already is. And that's very true. Now, most people think you're a likable guy. But it would take me three weeks to turn 90% of everybody you know in your daily life against you. And all I'd have to do is go, don't you remember that thing he did? Wasn't that kind of a little bit agitating? And within three weeks, I could have you where people absolutely loathed and detested you. Now's when you fire back and you go, well, I can do the same to you. Yes. Yes. And that's the point here. Someone in your church not like one of your elders? Well, you know, so-and-so, they did. Didn't we learn anything? Didn't we learn anything about not grabbing dogs by their ears? Didn't we learn anything by the whole I'm only joking? Didn't we learn anything from any of that? Shut your mouth. Well, I didn't like what the preacher said on this. I didn't like that point in the sermon. He should have. You know what? Quit. Quit. You're just saying this because you're a preacher. Uh-uh. Now I'm saying it for the preachers that come behind me in congregations. I try to tell every congregation, don't badmouth me. And I'm not the only preacher they ever badmouthed. Almost every church I've ever gone to, I heard nothing. I've heard, you know, them tell me everything bad about the preacher before me. And I tell them, quit. Quit. Well, the preacher before you, quit. quit let that stuff die out because guess what if Tyler's been trying to get his second cousin to come to church for the last 30 years but every preacher that comes along Tyler speaks nothing but bad about him for 30 years and then finally a preacher comes along that Tyler likes you know what his second cousin's waiting for? Him to say, me to say something else bad about this preacher. Yep. He's waiting for that shoe to fall. Well, you like him now because you liked all the others for the last 30 years for a while. And then all you did was complain about how terrible the people they were till they left. And what that ends up doing as time goes on, guess, believe it or not, sets you up where you've got no witness. Mm -hmm. So quit. Quit whispering, quit quarreling, quit complaining. I'm Brian Reagan. This is Tyler Kelly. And we'll see you tonight.